it's an interesting story. I, I had the good fortune to, to grow up, I guess you might say, in a very interesting place at a very interesting time. The place was in Mississippi and the time was uh, the latter part of the 1950s, my teenage years. In 1957, I went to uh, a Bo Diddley concert in Laurel, Mississippi. And I remember the first time that I ever heard what did I say. I played the 45 RPM record until the needle went through the plastic. When I went to see Bo Diddley, I, I wanted to be a guitar player, so I went and told my dad that I wanted to be a guitar player, and he told me that I, I shouldn't do it, that guitar players are sorry, they don't pay their bills. Uh, sometimes I think I should have listened to him. Finally got good enough to get in a couple little groups and got in one group and I built all the gear that they needed. As every group needs gear, so I built the gear that they needed and an interesting thing happened. About the time I finished all the gear, they kicked me out and hired another guitar player. After that third time though, that really got me. I looked in the mirror and I said, well, sport, it looks like you're not going to be a rock star, so what are you going to do? And I decided that uh, I was pretty good at building things and I love music and I love musicians. And I decided to do what every musician that I'd ever met up until that point in my life uh, had said. They said, I wish somebody would make good gear at a fair price. I decided to do it the best way that I possibly could. And we were the first people <clears throat> in 1960, no, in 1976 and 77. We started making guitars using computer control machines and everybody said it couldn't be done. Here in 2013, almost every company that makes guitars uses the equipment that we pioneered back in the mid-70s. Now, PV makes uh, well over 2,000 products. We sell to 136 countries throughout the world, and we're one of the few people in our industry that has received the highest award that the United States Commerce Department gives for excellence in exporting. It's called the E-Star Award. And if you notice the flag flying out front of our place, uh, the white flag with a star on it, that's the E-Star Award. We still have the same goal, to be the best. And we know that to be the best, uh, we have to be different. And I guess I could uh, exemplify that by the fact that uh, we've earned over 180 patents worldwide, which we've never done a study of it, but I believe that's probably more than all of our competitors put together. It isn't a company that just builds things, we also build people. And it's been that way for many, many, many years. I have people that, that have literally been with me for over 40 years that are still here. One of the things that sets PV apart, I think, and you see this almost everywhere you go inside the company, is, is passion. And most people are passionate about some form of music. And music is, uh, is a way of speaking to people without words. And uh, the power of music is, is phenomenal.